All right, so the April Fool's update is here and they added a couple things. One of which is this NPC up here that you can literally only find in specific servers. You go ahead and talk to him. He'll sell you an item for 999 gold, which is the fusion jacket, which you only have one of. And you need this item to make the brand new Veco unit or however you say it. So you have to server hub a bunch of private servers or public servers to try to find this. And the other items you need for this is you need 30 rare units, 15 Gokus and 15 Vegetas. And they're not on the normal banner. So let's go ahead and I'm guessing summon on the special banner and try to get 15 of each. You can also do shinies, which is five of each. <coughs> I'm going to turn off auto sell for rares. Let's see if we can get 15 of each of those. There's one Goku, a Vegeta. Okay, we got one of each. Let's go look at the evolution real quick. See if it's actually 15. Yeah, look at this. You could evolve Goku and Vegeta with the jacket to get a secret unit. So we need to get 15 of each of these. I already have one of each. I wonder if I can get lucky and get all the other ones without spending all my gems. Let's see if we can do that. Another Goku, another Vegeta. Okay, that's two of each. Uh, I don't know if this is actually worth doing right now. If I should wait for it to pop on standard banner because it's like a really high chance just to get the unit. Yeah, I'm gonna wait 40 minutes. I'm gonna do the other part of the update, which are these new Demon Academy portals, which are actually very difficult. This steel plated enemies and like Godspeed enemies. Like there's like three times cost to mini range. This April Fool's update actually has quite a bit of stuff in it. I was not expecting this type of update at all. But yeah, I'm gonna wait for them to pop on standard banner because I'm not gonna spend a bunch of gems for this unit. That's probably not gonna be good. Considering it's only 1,000 gold and a bunch of rares to get. So I don't think it's going to be that good. Okay, here we go. Vegeta's in the banner. So I'm going to go ahead and summon for, I think, 13 more of these. And there we go. That is 15. So I have 15 of the Vegeta's now. Yep, that's enough. So now I only need 13 more Goku's. And then we can make this unit. So I'm going to wait for that to appear in banner. Which hopefully won't take too long. Ah, uh, look at this! Finally! Goku is here! <laughs> I can finally get the unit! Oh, I've literally been waiting for hours for the PR on banner. Okay, 13 to get. Let's get him early so I gotta spend all my money. There we go. Okay, we got way more than enough. There we go. Let's go see if we can evolve the unit now. So here we go. 15 Gokus, way more than enough Vegeta's because he's also on the banner. And also the cape we got from the unit that spawns in occasionally in servers. Let's go ahead and evolve. Oh my God, that is the ugliest thing I've ever seen. And I love it so much. Let's go, dude. No, um, no shards for that, sadly. Aw, not shards. Those are little um, evolve things. But look at that. Oh my God, that is so ugly. I love it so much. Is it, does it have a cosmetic? No cosmetic yet. It is a secret unit though. What is it? Does it have a description? Yeah, there you go. And I did it too late. I got an April 2nd one. No, if it was 11 minutes earlier, I could have had an April 1st one, but nope. Unfortunate, but look at that unit. That is so good. Um, let's go look at the stats on it. And I do have to say, I don't think it's going to be that good considering the damage is super low despite being level 100. Despite being level one, this damage is still really low. If I feed it a little bit of levels, we'll make it level 68 just for the fun of it. Damage is still super, super low. So I don't think this unit is going to be good. So either way, I just want to see what it does because it is such a stupid unit. Look at the face. Oh God, it's so ugly. Also, I'm saying this so that way everyone is on the same mindset with this unit. This is an April Fool's unit. You literally got this by getting 30 rares and a 1,000 gold item. It's not going to be good. I haven't seen the stats yet, but I know it's not going to be good. So I'm not bothering to max it out either. So let's take a look at the attack on it. Does healer just run at them and does a belly flop? Is that what he does for real? What's with the Peter Griffin face it has? <laughs> he has a Peter face for real. <laughs> that is so stupid. I love it. Okay, let me get some money because I don't know how expensive this unit is going to be. I guess I'll just max out the speed wagons. That might be enough. Okay, let's go ahead and level the unit up. I did have to spam them, which I now know has five placements. I had to spam them because they don't do enough damage to actually even one-shot units on the lowest infinite. So honestly, this is the most early game, early game unit that I've ever shown to be early game. It's actually not that hard to get either. It's just 30 rares. So any like new play, if you're new to the game, like if you're new to the game, I would not sell the Vegetas or the um, Gokus. Keep those units because this unit is free to make and it's much better than a rare but it is much worse than a mythical it's around it's kind of like around the strength as fire fist so imagine this is, came out around the time of fire fist which is like one of the earliest secrets in the game but let's go ahead and let's see how strong this unit gets i'm actually curious this is level 68 by the way 
Um, first upgrade is 1.5 thousand damage. Same cooldown, one more range. Uh, 1,000 more damage, so it goes up by like a pretty good percentage. Uh, 6.8 cooldown and one more range. Then a pretty big jump of damage again. One less cooldown, that's nice. And then nine more... 0.9 more range. The another upgrade is more damage. Decent amount more damage. Same cooldown and one more range. Then a really big jump in damage. That's a really big jump. Uh, same cooldown and one more range. No other attacks. What? <laughs> well, I mean, at least he still belly flops. He has that going for him. Look at this unit, dude. It is so stupid. <laughs> The way he runs! The way he runs in this camera! <laughs> I just imagine... I just imagine the anime running lines when he does this. <laughs> I love that! <laughs> I love this unit! This unit is so stupid! It was so worth summoning for! Get this unit! Even if you... <laughs> Get it! It is so worth it! It is so stupid! I love this unit so much. If you're new to the game, it's probably worth trying to save up for. It's only 1,000 gold, which really isn't that much. And then you just have to get a bunch of rares, which honestly, low levels, you specialize at this. So go for it. Unlucky players unite. My lord, this unit is not good. D don't get this unit if you're like already have mythicals, unless you just kind of want to get it for fun, which I still recommend doing. Oh my gosh, this is great.